my friends, today I have some good news. Oh, glory to God. The prophet Isaiah prophesied about Egypt that in the Bible it is considered as a place of sin and there were many gods. They were all worshiping these gods and all. And what the prophet Isaiah prophesied will happen to this nation. Then the Lord will be known to Egypt and the Egyptians will know the Lord in that day. What a beautiful thing on that day. And it is coming, folks. Yes, that day has come, the day that Jesus came to this world and will make sacrifice and offering. Yes, they will make a vow to the Lord and perform it. Have you ever thought about what God has prepared for you? Give praise to God because you will be a very blessed person. In the name of Jesus Christ, shall we say a prayer now for your life? But watch this quick video first. It's been 20 years that I couldn't raise my arms. Look at her, folks. For almost 20 years. I how, fell and... How high could you raise them before? Only up to here. Would it and hurt? And I couldn't even hang my clothes on the but clothesline. But would it hurt? Yes, it hurt. So raise both arms now. Bring her up here. Bring her up here. There, there you go. How old are you now, sister? I'm 76 years old. Almost my age, sister. <laughs> We both are 76 years old, sister. Sister, for how long couldn't you raise your arms? For 20 years, pastor. How high could you lift them? Only up to here. And I couldn't hang the clothes on the clothesline. But the clothesline is high today. Put the clothes there now. I couldn't, pastor. What about now? Put the clothes there now. Look at that, folks. She can raise it all the way up now. God bless you, sister. Now I want to pray, oh Lord God. I came to pray for all these people who are in Egypt, a place that they don't know you, whether here or in any country in the world. My God, they are deceived in false religions. But Father, now I bind all evil, all deceit in their lives, and I order it to leave them, to go away, don't stay any longer. In the name of Jesus, and you say, Amen. Glory to God for this, and have a good day.